Now on page 17 you're going to be doing the instrument panel. So remove the part which is S37 from its fret and then you need to prime it and then paint it black. And then you can pick out some small details if you wish to before cutting out the backing on the printed paper of the instrument panel as seen here. Okay, and then once we've got that, you will then be putting the metal instrument panel over the top of the paper, back in so that all your dials show through like so. And then once you've done that, we're going to then prepare parts 1G and 1L and then stick the instrument panel onto those wooden parts. Now, as you can see, we've continued with the stages 34 to 39. And as you can see here, we've got the instrument panel, the backing, and the wooden parts all made up. So set that aside, allow that to dry. You can use a little bit of varnish, okay, for the lenses. Let that to dry. And once you've done that, you then need to take the control levers. And as you can see here, once you've cleaned them up, and as shown in stage 40, you've got the parts SD06, and I don't know if you can see that. We then place them into position at the front. If you can't see that, just look at the photograph and you'll see them in there. So glue those into position, and then we're going to add the instrument panel and the seats that we assembled earlier. Now, as you can see, we've got the instrument panel assembly in position, and you can see that through the back. Okay, and next we're going to be adding the seats, putting the seats into position. <laughs> 